Welcome back to my more important analysis videos with me, Richard Power Market Analyst at Hantech Markets, looking at cable now. Um, we've got this cable rally that's been ongoing for the past sort of week or so, um, and it's now into, um, a bu well, it reached above 25 big figure yesterday, and sort of pushing out towards the test of these highs, 25.70, 25.80 area. Um, Today's early morning candle has been a little bit corrective, um, 30 pips down on the day. There's been um, a suggestion that um, from uh, MPC member Gerten Vlieg, uh, although my Dutch acts, um, pronunciation is probably not great, um, but he would he's suggesting that even up at sort of three and a half percent inflation, um, that doesn't necessarily mean you're going to get a rate hike from the Bank of England. So that's sort of put Sterling under a little bit of pressure today, and um, just slightly underperforming the other majors. Um, but nothing too significant, and uh, more of a bit of a consolidation, really. Around 60 on the RSI. Stochastics, yeah, they are sort of crossing over, aren't they? On the brink, possibly. Um, but I think, generally speaking, we're still playing this as a range play, um, as the market just trends uh, sideways over the past sort of five, six months, really. And um, within that, I think the bulls would be hoping, certainly, for a a serious test of this 2570, 2580 er, um, areas of resistance that we had in February. And a failure around this level here would start to put more of a sort of negative bias within the range, I think. Um, and it'll be interesting to see if that is the case, that we do start to see the market topping out 2530. Um, the reaction today has sort of been testing this uptrend that we've had on the hourly chart but not yet broken it. Uh, I think a move below 24.20, which was um, Wednesday's reaction, I think that would change the outlook near term. But you look at these momentum indicators, they're still sort of holding 40 on the RSI, holding neutral on the MACD line. So you'd still say that little correction chance to buy, perhaps. I mean, the, um, the, the previous um, correction on Tuesday um, found support around that 89-hour moving average. And we're still trading above that now, so it's um, it's still intact as a recovery play, um, but it's being tested today. Um, so uh, it'll be very interesting to see how the market sort of turns uh, on this one because it's a little bit of a near-term crossroads, I think, and um, the uh, cable traders will be looking out for that. So I wish you good luck in your trading today, and I'll speak to you later. Thank you.